This is the double fisher person's knot. It's useful for joining two pieces of rope together, ideally of the same diameter, or for closing the loop on a single piece of rope, which is what we're gonna be doing now. So take your two strands, uh, lay them out parallel to one another, and then we're gonna start with this one. I'm gonna start by wrapping it up over this way, over the other one. Remember that the direction we went on this one was up first. We're gonna wrap it around once, and notice that when I wrapped it, I wrapped it back over itself. Not up this way, but back this way. I'm gonna wrap it one more time, and then you'll notice that there's a, there's a hole that we can then pass the rope back through right here. So we're gonna pass it through and cinch it down. Now, if you remember with this strand, we, went, we looped it up that way, so with this one, we're gonna loop it down the other way. Remember, we cross back over the rope. And then through again. And if you did the loops in opposite directions, you'll notice that the knot will actually nestle together quite nicely. These two pieces will fall in together and align. Now with the double fisher person's knot, you always make sure that you have enough tail to go back over the knot with both sides. It's then very, it's a good idea to set the knot, pull on it really hard to make sure that it's not gonna come undone.